young age, trying to make a bit. Now that I'm up, they all my dick. Nope. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I am doing a holiday lookbook, and I'm featuring pieces that I got this month from a monthly clothing subscription company. I have a very minimalist wardrobe, and I'll do a whole capsule wardrobe video at a later date. But for this month, I decided it was a good month to try out Newly. At the end of the video, I'm going to give you my thoughts and environmental impact review, and whether I would rent from Newly again. So how Newly works is you get to rent six pieces per month. At the end of the month, you get to keep the pieces you like and you pay a discounted retail price to keep them and you return the pieces you don't like. The price they advertise is $88 per month, but they didn't include taxes. So with Seattle taxes, it came out to be $98 for a month of rental. So this month, the first piece I chose is this pair of Ogoldi jeans, which I've heard a lot of good things about Ogoldi jeans. And I don't know if I'm saying it right, Unfortunately, I picked a size way too big, so I've been unable to wear it and I didn't feature it in this video. The next piece I picked is this flowy red dress. Super comfortable. It is a little bit worn. Definitely does not feel brand new. Next piece I ordered, this one I absolutely love and I'm really considering keeping it. And I think it's about $40 to keep. It's this orange turtleneck sweater, but it's multifunctional. You can unbutton this side to expose the shoulder. And for some of my minimalist wardrobe, multifunctional pieces are valuable. Next is this striped, slightly cropped bell bottom top. This is a fun little number. Don't think I'm gonna keep this one, but it's been good having it in the meantime. Next is this color block sweater, which I'm really into big statement colorful sweaters. Also don't think I'm gonna keep this one. This one definitely felt a little bit used and it's a little bit too big. This next piece I absolutely love. It's a blazer dress and I wore it to a company holiday party. This is one of the great things about renting it. I wore it once. I had a great time with it. I might also wear it on New Year's Eve, but I don't see myself wearing it a lot again. So that's what I'm gonna return even though I loved it. Okay, now to take a look at the environmental impact. So I did a little study and I'm measuring the environmental impact on two factors. One, the amount of water used to produce the clothing and the amount of carbon emitted in the production of the clothing item and in the transportation. So we're gonna have two groups of people. The first group is the buyer's group. This is a group of six people and they are purchasing six cotton t-shirts per month, every month. The next group are the newlyers. And these are people that are using Newly. They're renting six pieces per month, every month. So that means they have to ship those six items to their house and return it at the end of the month. And I'm assuming that all these people in both groups live exactly a hundred miles away from a shipping center. So again, we're assuming that in the span of a year, every month, the buyer's group is ordering six cotton t-shirts per person, and they're getting that one shipment to each person's house. In the newly group, they're renting six pieces per month. In order to sustain these six people who are renting six unique pieces per month for a year, newly needs to produce 72 items of clothing. After one year, Newly is a lot more environmentally friendly option when looking at the water usage and carbon emission. After one year, the people who are buying six new cotton t-shirts per month 
used 2.3 million liters of water and emitted 2,300 kilograms of carbon, whereas the newly years only used 200,000 liters of water and 1,100 kilograms of carbon. Now, if we were to extend this and assume that the buyer's group have bought enough clothing after one year, they have 72 pieces of clothing in their wardrobe now, but the newly years have to continue to rent because they aren't keeping the pieces. So then after three years, the newly years have started to emit more carbon, mostly because of the transportation required to transport the clothing from the shipping center to the person's house and back at the end of every month. And that's assuming that the buyers aren't buying any more clothing. Now, after 12 years, newly users' water consumption have caught up as well. So newly is definitely producing less clothing because they're being reused by different people through the subscription model. Of course, we gotta remember that this environmental impact study was done under a lot of assumptions. We're assuming that people are buying only cotton t-shirts, that they're buying from the same company because water produced and carbon emitted by the production of clothing really varies by company and what their factory practices are. We're assuming that they wash the clothes the same, assuming they all live in the same location. So it's just important to remember these things. And of course, remember that there are a lot of environmentally friendlier options. Right off the bat, I'm thinking walking to a thrift store, buying a secondhand piece that will last you a long time. So far this month, I am really loving four out of the six pieces I rented. One just absolutely does not fit me, which are the jeans. And the color block sweater has been great. I've been wearing it here and there, but it is a little bit too big and definitely feels a little worn. I think I would use Newly again, but I wouldn't use it every month. It's something for those seasons where you wear pieces that you would only wear once, like the holiday season where there's a lot of holiday parties and New Year's Eve going on. I think Newly is a great option. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, stay fashionable, stay environmental, maybe try Newly. I'll leave a code down below. It's not a sponsored video, it's just like a referral code which anyone can get. So if you click it, you get $20 off your first month. Let me know what you think and leave it in the comments down below. Don't forget to also like this video and subscribe. It's free. Bye. Never thrown a brick, just trying to keep it cool. Like it's ice on my wrist. God give it talent. Been feeling blessed. Kept it 100 like an Asian's mad test.